Guys, welcome back to my channel. Now, as you see right here, I've got three turtles. <laughs> now, the reason why I do this quick film and video about the three turtles is because my friends asked me the question, hey, Felix, why, why are you buying the same shape and designer watches in different colors? I mean, um, and I've got my wife asking me, hey, why are you picking up the same watch three times? I mean, uh, you know, I thought about it from an individual perspective, someone that I did not fall in love with the design of turtles when I first saw it, that uh, probably 2017 or 18, right? Now, three years forward, I'm not having three. Right? I just want to share a bit of my experiences, my journey of why, why I currently have three turtles in my collection. Now, this might work for you. You might not like it. You might not like the turtles at all. But I do think I have a good point because I believe, you see, the, the, the love of watches coming all in different reasons and motivations. And as a, a beginner in this hobby and journey, I decided that the, the approach of giving me the most amount of joy and fun is by having selections of watches, okay, with a brand and history and the story that I can relate myself in and as well as of course the functionality has to suit my day-to-day -day life all that kind of stuff okay? so when it comes to turtle because it is so affordable they are so robust and they're widely accessible and and the turtle is gonna last I mean you will still see Seiko's making turtles 20 30 years from now that's for sure Right, and because they can do every single color dial so perfectly according to its price, and I think it's almost silly not to consider the approach of just buying two to three colors. Um, I guess you know a dark color, a, a vibrant color, or light color. Right? I can't really think of any light color of the title on the current um, uh, um, Seiko collections, but it can go in sort of in different. Color scheme to matches to a different style. So I currently have the SRP seven seven five. This is a J version, and this is of course the seven seven seven, the, the black, and this is I believe the SRP C twenty five. So you can see those colors. I mean, they work tremendously well together. Um, the ones for summer. I mean, you can probably wear suits and dress with the middle one, I believe, or the one with the gold color. And in terms of, you know, when it comes to utility, you can see this one's on a leather strap, the 775. The black one is on a bracelet. I think that this bracelet is coming from this one, okay? Uh, and the SRP C25 is on a rubber strap, you see? They look amazing, guys. The cost of those three watches adding up together, of course, depending where you're at, whether you want to buy the K version or you want to find the J version, you can buy three of them well under a thousand bucks. And you're going to have a lot of spare. And you can have spend the money on different straps, and potentially a better bracelet if you're that type of sort of type of guy, right? But I just enjoy the vibration of, you know, different colors stimulates me in a different way. And I think it's great. So I want to put in this trail here, the, the, the Seiko trail, I'm happy. I'm really happy. Now, if I'm imagining that I'm gonna sell three of those in return for another individual piece that cost me, like I said, around a thousand bucks, right? Look, I'm not a watch expert knowing, you know, what's the best value on a thousand bucks or thereabouts, but why well, trade it for a single watch that worth a thousand bucks? Let's say another, you know, the SPB 147 that I'm also having my collection, or let's say uh, uh, a Presage, a premium model, all right? Again, we'll talk about your Seiko collection, right? Or we're talking about I'm trading at, I don't think you can afford, uh, you know, you can afford some uh, very basic entry level Swiss brand around a thousand bucks level T sold. Um, I think this uh, PRX, very popular. I haven't touched that watch yet, but I think it's very popular. Were I traded for that? I don't think so. I don't think so, so far. Maybe I'll change my mind. <laughs> I don't really know. But for now, this trail just gave me a lot of joy. And I think it will do to you too as well. If you can allocate a thousand bucks, look into the shape, just have a bit of fun with it. Buying a couple of different colors. And you know what? If you do decide to sell them, I'm pretty sure you can get about at least 60 to 70% or even 80% of your money back. 
within about six to 12 months if you sort of don't make too much damage just about the watch, okay? So that's it, guys. I just want to put those free trails here. Just have a bit of fun, different colors, and hope you enjoy the video, all right? No matter where you're at, stay safe. Uh, have a lot of fun with your life. And be well, okay? I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye for now.